In the wake of the devastating storms and subsequent flooding in Texas caused by Hurricane Harvey, people's lives were turned upside down. Many had lost homes and were scrambling for shelter, food, and water. Those who had homes to return to often faced shortages of supplies, as well as long work ahead repairing damage caused by the storm. Father John Capucci of St. Malachy Catholic Church and his staff are working on a Cookies for Harvey Victims fundraiser to help those in need. He said the images from the disaster area stirred him to action as they simultaneously reminded him of a similar experience he had lived through. People were in pain. When I was watching it on television, I had a flashback. In 2005, I was stationed in New Orleans. I was at the Center of Jesus the Lord. It was on the corner of North Rampart and Esplanade on the back corner of the French Quarter, and Hurricane Katrina was coming. I evacuated because the news said so. I thought I'd be home by Tuesday, and all of a sudden I got a phone call at 2 in the morning from a friend of mine saying, Father, Father, the, the levees in the, in the river has overflown into the city. New Orleans is flooded. I couldn't believe. When I was watching Hurricane Harvey and the effect it had in, in um, Houston and Beaumont and all around the whole coast, Gulf Coast of Texas, I couldn't help but to think of what happened during Katrina. Father Capucci said in the aftermath of Katrina, people from all over the country stepped up to help by sending much needed funds that allowed him and his parishioners to help their neighbors to rebuild homes and buy groceries and other needed supplies. With that in mind, he decided he needed to do something for the victims of Harvey. After speaking with a fellow priest in the affected area, he decided to raise funds for the people in the small community of Finette, Texas, where about 250 homes were flooded. He said he wanted the money raised to go directly to people rather than the agencies, and he wanted the event to be a fund for participants. And so we came up with the idea of Cookies for Harvey, and we're going to give out mugs. And these mugs, the Cookies for Harvey, you can fill them with milk, you fill with coffee or tea, whatever you like. And um, we have 150, 152 dozen homemade cookies coming to this event. And you can walk around our church hall with a, with a mug of coffee, tea, or milk, and dunk your cookies and enjoy your, your time together. During the Cookies for Harvey fundraiser, there will be a silent auction with items including Red Sox playoff tickets and a nine-course meal from soup to nuts made by Father Capucci himself. People are also encouraged to make donations directly to help the people of Finette. What will happen is everybody um, who has purchased a mug, um, these mugs will be sent down to Texas. There will be a little note inside saying, you know, dear friend, this little gift to you is being offered um, to help you in a difficult time. Know you're in our prayers, our thoughts, and we only want the best things for you. Love, and maybe your first name. That will go inside. We're going to do a little sleeve of those little cookies, like you might put in like a little kid's lunchbox, um, some kind of one of those little pre-made cookies. A little sleeve of those cookies will go in there, and a check to each person who's being assisted. They then will get this, and then it will be handed to them on behalf of our parish, our town here in Burlington, as a town event saying, here, this, a town in Burlington, in Massachusetts, Burlington, Massachusetts, cares about you. Father Capucci said he expects a good turnout at the fundraiser yeah, because he knows the generosity of the people of Burlington. I'm going to say what I said. When a catastrophe happens, the best of all people rise to the top. And my experience of Burlington folk is that they're great people. They know others' needs. Their hearts are big. They want to help. Sometimes we don't always know how to help. Sometimes we're suspicious of who, who we want to help, or how to help, or what agencies to assist. That's why this is going to go directly to people. And I think when people know what they're doing is touching an individual, I think it touches their hearts more than it touches the people down in Finette, Texas. I think their, their hearts are going to know that they've changed another person's viewpoint of
of what it means to be part of the human race and what it means to be loved and cared for 2,000 miles away. Cookies for Harvey will be at St. Malachy Catholic Church from 6.30 to 8.30 on Saturday, September 30th. At St. Malachy's, I'm B News Director Rich Hosford.